Ready? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, can you stand over there? Sure. Okay, thanks. Uh, wait a second. Okay, sorry. I just stuffed my my stuffed my things in my bag today. I was trying to yeah, get no, out of the fine. storm. Okay. Yeah. Ready? No, I, it's crazy out there. I wouldn't blame you. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Okay. I am here with Mr. Brian Zimmerman, a supporting actor from the newest film from Ralph Bennings, who made some waves last year at Rhode Island Film Festival with his indie film Moonshots. Not to jump right into a question, but I wanted to ask Brian, what's it like working with an up-and-coming director like Bennings? Well, it's not much different than working with anyone else, I would think. And who else have you worked with? Um, I did a commercial a while back. It uh, wasn't really too important, but uh, I did a short film for Pete Dawson back in 2013. Uh, that was The Fracture. But other than that, not really... Else. So, what can you tell us about this short film? Uh, Benning seems to be intent on keeping most of the details of a secret since his announcement. He does say it is a thriller of some kind, though. Yeah, it's... He's been kind of keeping things under wraps a lot. Like, he doesn't really want anyone to know a lot about what he's, what he's doing. So, not even for this kind of thing? I don't, I don't think so. I really don't even know why he wanted to do this in the first place. Like, have behind the scenes stuff. It just would have sounds counterintuitive, you know? Yeah, I, I, I can talk about my character though, I think. No. Yeah, sure. Go, go ahead. ahead. I probably oh, go ahead. Stop. Jesus. Fine, show me then. I think they're just they're just rehearsing. Yeah. Um do you wanna have like this. Ugh. Oh Oh my god. Oh okay. Happened. Yeah, it did. That doesn't look. That doesn't look like the prop knife. That's because it's not. Oh my god. What are we gonna do? Taylor, oh my god. I think you need to turn the camera off. What do you what? mean no. the camera? Why do you? Why are you recording you're just, this? They're just doing an interview it? over there. Oh I my god. Why I didn't think something like this was gonna happen. Oh something god. like what, Zimmerman? Oh my god. Something like the fact that Benny just killed Artie. <laughs> Benny killed Artie. Dude, shut up. No, you. Oh. No. Not get scared on my face right now. Where are you going? What? Okay, I really, I really think you better turn that, turn no, that off. No, no, I'm Taylor. not. I'm not. It's evidence. Taylor. It's evidence. Taylor. You got your evidence. Look. You got everything you need. I can use it for the police. Taylor, it's, I know that you think important. this is a good idea, but I please turn the camera off. No, please. I. What? Why? 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 Turn the camera off. Because you just killed Artie. Art is dead. You just stabbed Artie! I suppose from your perspective it must seem that way. What other perspective, ma'am? I'm just saying that from your perspective it must seem like I just stabbed her and killed someone in cold blood in the middle of this living room. That's... That is exactly what you just did. That was the first time. Oh my god. What? What the... Hmm? Oh my god, here she comes. If you two were real actors, then this wouldn't be a joke to you. Why would we be joking about this, Arkansas? Arkansas? It's a screen name. She's a method actress. Screen name? You're really funny. Just in a couple of months, Conrad Arkansas will be inked on my birth certificate, and you won't have anything to say about it. Okay, whatever. Are you so full of yourself that you're oblivious to the fact that he just killed someone? I'm far from oblivious, and... She wasn't a good actress anyways, so it's a, all a win-win for us. Fine. Oh. You. And um, before you start chewing me out, would you be against me having a word with your little friend over there? You're done, buddy. Right. Thanks, buddy. Okay. Hi. Hi. Um, Ralph Bennings, though. So I think you already knew that. Yeah. Based on your body language, I'm making you pretty uncomfortable, yeah? Yes. All right, figures, then uh, I'll make this brief. Whatever you do, I want you to record everything that happens here. Well, 
all of it. Just keep filming and don't stop filming unless I tell you otherwise. Uh, based on the fact that you already recorded a little altercation over there with Miss Baxter, it shouldn't be too hard for you, should it? No, no, not hard at all. Wonderful. Good. Well, we should keep you occupied for the next few hours. Next few hours? Yeah, with the storm and all, I don't really see anyone leaving, do you? We should just go. Oh, and this mess? Be my guest. Hey, even if we could leave, how would that help anything here? Fine, what do you suggest? I suggest we do the obvious thing here and just call the police. Are you nuts? As a matter of fact, I'm not. Can you say the same? If you call the police, you're sabotaging this entire shoot, you're sabotaging Brenning's career, and most importantly, you're sabotaging mine. Last time I checked, you didn't kill anyone. Yeah, not yet. What? what? Oh, oh my god, okay. I'm, I'm leaving, goodbye. I... What do you mean? I can tell whatever this is isn't gonna work out too well for us, so I'm gonna go. Bye. What? You, she can't just leave. You can't just leave. Send me my check in the mail. Good riddance. She was a rookie anyways. What did you mean by that? You mean by what? When you said not yet, what did you mean? Just drop it, okay? Leave me alone. Are you telling me you're okay with all of this? I'm okay with saving the dead horse we call Hollywood, pal. We live in Rhode Island! Oh, shut up, I can't hear you. These people are insane. Ryan, what are you gonna do? I don't know! I need to think. Uh, hey. Hey. Hmm? Yes? What are you, why are you two old chummy all of a sudden? Because I'm a people person and because shut up, I'm talking with my friend. Yeah, some real down to earth humans. What, you say this because I'm Russian? Oh, no, no. Oof, and a hefty accusation from T. I didn't mean it, like, I didn't mm. know. No more cans, just join me. Are we going out of field trip? Yes, we're going out of field Gee. Brian. Where, Brian, where are you going? I'm going to find Bennings. Don't follow me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey, who are you? I'm Kevin. Kevin, who are you? The special effects guy. Sorry, I'm late. Sorry. Um, what's... What is this? It's kind of a funny story, actually. You know this was, this was my job. It looks fake as hell, even. I, I, I have something to break to you. Wh what? It, 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 it's not fake. It's, it's real. This is real? Yeah. You're telling... Don't freak out, don't freak out, please. I just said when I see real blood. You're, you're okay, breathe. Breathe, everything's fine. If, oh, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Brian! Brian! Oh my god! Oh my, Brian, Brian, Brian. Hello? Anyone want to notice me? I thought I told you not to follow me, Taylor. Yeah, 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 he's he's up, Brian. He's up. This is good footage. I'm yeah, glad Shut up, she's... shut up. Five seconds. What? A girl named Tanya came, and then and, 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 and her and Conrad were old buddy-buddy, okay, okay. and, then, and then someone passed out. And okay, okay. It's all right. You know this water over here if you need some, right? Okay. You, you have two options, all right? You can call the cops and admit what you've done, or you don't have to. And I'll do it for you. Because you're not going to get away with this in any way. You're not. You have a chance to do the right thing. What are you going to do? Good speech. Did you just come up with this one yourself? Look. How long on the news have they been talking about this uh, storm, Brian? And uh, even if you were to call the cops, which I wouldn't let you, um, how exactly would they get here? How long would it take? Why does this matter? matters because I want you to see, Brian, I want you to see and open your eyes to this beautiful mystery that I have created solely for you, the lead actor. I don't understand why you can't just
just do that. There's a deliberate destiny manufactured by me on your doorstep for you to discover. The journalist, the storm, me. Come on, put this together, buddy, because I know you know. Brian, what does he mean? You... You planned this whole day just so that we couldn't leave. Fucking us. He sees it. Bingo, Brian! No. Hey, do not get angry with me, Brian. Hey, I'm about to give you exactly what you want, okay? Exactly what I want? Yeah. Exactly. What is that? Bolton, obviously! Who's Bolton? Care to tell? Nice camera lady? About to our benefactor? Vince Bolton is the producer, works in Seacon, he's funding this whole thing. Indeed. So I say, why don't we collectively go call him and see what he has to say about all this? Maybe he'll provide some insight. Perhaps. Go ahead. There you go. Oh, I, uh, I see that Kevin made it. How did, how did this, how did that happen? He fainted. Some of you got that on camera. All right, shot. Get over here. Keep the camera on him, please. Really? You, know, you think I'm going to try something on YouTube right now? Yeah, it's I, ridiculous. I don't, I don't care about anything that you're saying right now. I think if you want to keep up this psycho jigsaw murder act, whatever you're doing, yeah, no, the camera's going to stay all right, on. All right, all right. Yeah. All right. So shall I call the chief? Yeah. Are we, are we calling Bolton or not? Just a sec. Just do it! It's ringing. Put it on speakerphone. Yeah. Just Christ, this better be good. Hey. Hey, V, how you doing? No, don't be me, Bennings. What did you do? Oh. This is my personal line. What happened, huh? What stuff did you call during this guy? Um, Vince Bolton's a woman? Yeah, you got a problem with that? No, 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 sorry. Uh, Vince, the, uh, the aggression, frankly, is kind of uncalled for, and it's a, it's a bit hurtful, too. I don't care about your feelings, Ralph. Just tell me what happened so I can go home. All right. Well, then, uh, do, uh, do you remember that talk we had? Well, I do. The talk we had last April, it was, uh, about that Bloomfield guy, the whole incident with him, and, uh, how we had to try and prevent that kind of thing from ever happening again. Oh, tell me you did it. Mm. Ralph! Mm-hmm. Yeah? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. You can't be... Of course you're serious! Ralph, we talked about this! I thought this was clear! Hold on. You're saying that... You know about this, and you're 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 okay with this. Well, who is that? Uh, well, that's that is one of the fine young men working under my helm, Vince. Uh, his name is Brian Zimmerman. He's been a real champ. He's he's probably one of the project's best assets at the Ralph, moment. Ralph, Ralph, and, shut up and just listen, please. Please don't tell me that you did this in front of your actors. Don't tell me that you just did okay, this. I may have done that. Okay. Okay, um, hi, hello. I still, I still need to make sure that... Has he... He's done this before? And if he has, you, you're you letting him? Um, do, uh, okay, I can. You three are lucky my wife has me listening to those self-help tips, or I'd march through the snow and beat you all with a tire iron. Needless. These are needless things. Twice? Genius? Yes. It's hard to admit, but seriously, did you guys see Moontrap? That was the next level stuff. For real. Thank you, Vince. So, so, so you're saying that 
that makes it okay for him to be murdering people. His movies just just excuses what he's doing. Look, Ralph is he's a bit off, okay? I'll give you that. Wow. Way to undo the compliment you just gave me, Vince, but okay, go on. Continue. <sighs> Who benefits from killing actors, Vince? Well, coroners, I think. And, and morgue workers, coffin makers. Oh my gosh. You're delusional. You're just so delusional. Both of you are insane. You're both insane. I'm just gonna call the cops. I'm just gonna do it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey there, slow down. It's Brian, right? Listen to me, okay? I said this can be a little bit hard to believe. Oh, fair warning. Is that a threat? No, 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 no. It's not just some kind of threat. I'm just saying that maybe it would be best for everyone if we just kept this to ourselves for now. No reason to blow it out of proportion and get the police involved, right? Not when we can just crumb down a solution right now ourselves. No reason to be bogged down by some tragic accident, right? So you're saying that... Yes, I am saying that. So if we're on the same page here, could you just shut up and name your price already? Any consolation, Brian? I've never considered killing you. <laughs> Wait, why is he laughing now? I'm confused. Do, do you hear yourself when you talk? I try to, but um, sometimes it gets a little hard, you know. Okay. Well, um, hey Vince, I just want to let you know that you are insane and a horrible human being, and I wish you absolutely just the worst. As to you, Ralph. And um, I wanted to let you know, Vince, that um, we've been recording this entire time, and everything that you've said uh, we can use as evidence. So I'm going to go call the cops. Whoa, 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 what, what did he just say? Oh, uh, hey, Vince, you know, I'm going to have to call you back. Is that cool? No, Ralph, yeah, 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 I have to call you. Okay, bye. I'll... lines to your director. I don't know. I don't think you should be thinking at all because you were the one that started this in the first place. Oh, hey. Hey, where's Conrad? Hmm? Conrad. Or Kansas? Yeah. She or Kansas. too much. I wasn't finished yet. Oh, okay, okay. I, I am finished. I am... I've just... I've been finished this whole time. Well, I'm just trying to compliment you, Brian, seeing as your delivery over there with Bolton was spot on. I figured you might want, you know, some congratulations about that. Oh, yeah. yeah, well, um, yeah, well, I think you seem to forget that this isn't a movie! You're right, it's not a movie. This is an experience. And actually, I feel we all personally could benefit. Where's my mom? Where's my... Brian? Yeah. That scary woman's watching us. Hold that thought. Found it. I honestly don't hear this one. Hi. Hi? I need your phone. What? Why are you asking for that? Why do you speak, camera lady? I don't talk to you. <clears throat> I need to see your phone. I need to check something quickly. Please let me see it. I promise I get back. Where are you going with that? I swear you'll get this back. I Where promise you? on my phone. What? No. <laughs> Hold on. Wait. What? Oh my god. <laughs> Why would you do that? No cops. You were. No cops. Brian, are you okay? What is? Are you actors putting the actors? What is happening right now? Putting them Brian. in the heat of the moment. Okay. So that they shut up. Shut up, really. Yeah. Uh, sure you want to Who are you? Path, right? No. Give me your phone. Get that away from me. Brian. I won't be here. Brian. Brian, we have to go. Brian, we have to go. Brian, we have to go. Go.
before we begin, I have to ask you, did you ever get that paycheck? Now that I think about it, I didn't. Then please calm down. Where's my phone? What did she do with it? Who? The Russian. So, you're the Russian? Yeah. Uh, in English, please, ma'am. First you identify me by my nationality, then you insult my way of speak. You are off to bed stars, Mr. Lewis. Uh, excuse me? We spoke to, to Miss Petrenko, and she did, claimed she doesn't have it. She grabbed it after she tackled me. That commie is an absolute- Sir! Sir, to be fair, just because she's watching- She can't meet me with a knife man! You know, you look a bit familiar. Mm, no. If we knew each other, it would be I who did recognition instead. Huh? I watch, I see. I would have seen you seeing me. If we knew each other, Mr. Police, I would have seen you see me, instead of you seeing me. No. I am telling you, bro, this guy's deranged! You gotta arrest him! Will you give it back? Give what back? My camera, it's the only one with a copy of the footage, and I need to make one for me. Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, because <laughs> you know, journalism. Brian? the door? You want to open the door? You want to open the door? There he is, the man himself. What do you want? What do I want? Buddy, I'm just here to talk to you. I'm not your buddy. Look, Brian, I'm here. I happen to bump into one of my actors. What am I supposed to do? Like, pretend you're not here? This is a fine establishment, which I frequent in my times of travel Stop around it. this realm. And sometimes I... Look, Brian, take some show for this white on show, okay? Brian, maybe that... Awesome. Get back. Exactly. Right. See him? Mm -hmm. Wow! Haven't felt a rush like that in years, Brian! Oh, I'm sorry, did that hurt? No, actually, it felt great, Brian. It felt amazing. Really, we really got something. Look, I honestly feel like we got started on some... No, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Hey. All right, I won't touch you. You won't touch me. Fair and square. Now, all I feel, Brian, is that we started on the wrong foot. So, why don't we just call it square? Bygones. Truth. You are going to jail, Ralph. You are. <laughs> That'll be the day. No, Brian, the way I see it at least, pretty sure that this is my Paula Dean moment. I mean, plenty of people find themselves in plenty of precarious positions similar to this. Mel Gibson, O.J. Simpson, Martha Stewart, everybody. They didn't get in any trouble. Martha Stewart went to jail. O.J. Simpson, he went to jail. Even so, now they're living a the sweet life, Brian. I mean, Martha Stewart's got a new show. I can have a show. Don't you think I can have a show, Brian? Because I'm of the opinion that all these individuals... Why aren't you listening to me? Brian, all these individuals, all these people, you can learn. This is gonna kill your battery, man. It's an 
energy crisis, Brian. We cannot be affording to waste fossil fuels. Now, where do I leave off? Oh, I remember. OJ moment. OJ is better than Paula Dean because that and the racial thing. And as I said, you know, I'm much more on the side of that kind of thing. You're going to jail. Am I? Would you like to know why? Why, Brian? Please enlighten me. Do you really like to know why? You really want to know why? Yes. Because they have the footage. Taylor's footage? You know, the footage that you told her to film? They have that. And it's got all of the little nasty things that you did. Including you murdering Artie. So... You think I'm going to jail? Oh, I don't think. I know. If it's your bottle of soda, I won't go to jail. Oh, Ralph. I'm sweet, young, innocent Ralph. This is not a movie. But have fun in jail, because as long as you keep up that positive upbeat attitude you are you're gonna be just fine all right so have fun in jail you have fun right here i'm not just hold on are you ready i got some i got something really big okay sure you Who is that, Brian?